The UN Refugee Agency says more than 50 million people were forcibly uprooted worldwide at the end of last year, the highest level since after World War II as people fled the crisis from Syria to South Sudan. If uh, we have for the first time since the Second World War more than 50 million people displaced by war or by persecution, uh, it's uh, uh, because we are witnessing a multiplication of new conflicts in the world. And the global conflict generates global displacement. Uh, and at the same time, uh, uh, old conflicts seem never to die. Well, the solution is political. Uh, there is only one way to stop displacement is to stop conflict. It's to find peace. And that, it will, that capacity is uh, what it is lacking in today's world. But uh, uh, in between, people suffer. The report also showed that for the first time in the last 10 years, 50% of the world's refugees are children. There is a general sense of impunity. Uh, conflicts emerge. Uh, 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 dramatic violations of human rights uh, uh, appear. Uh, and uh, the international community has lost uh, much of its capacity to prevent conflict situations and to timely solve them. Well, the solution is political. Uh, there is only one way to stop displacement is to stop conflict. It's to find peace. And that, it will, that capacity is uh, what it is lacking in today's world. But uh, uh, in between, people suffer. We need to increase our capacity to deliver on the ground, and we need to have a much stronger solidarity from the international community to be able to cope with this dramatic challenge.